<clears throat> hey y'all, this morning on the way in, I was uh, driving, traffic wasn't too bad, so I was able to do a little thinking. It seems to me that we're kind of living in a science fiction world uh, with the some of the crazy stuff that's happening. It really seems to me that the world we live in was crafted by H.P. Lovecraft. Um, I don't know a lot about the guy. I know that uh, his writing was <clears throat> Kind of twisted. I mean, I've read I've read some of his stuff, and I like some of his stuff. I'm not recommending that you run out and grab it. One of my favorite, well, I can't say favorite. One of the most shocking things I've ever read was a story called uh, "The Coils of Medusa," and the thing that was shocking about it was. The climax of the story was the very last word. It just, I was shocked when I read it because I just was not expecting, I was not expecting it. And I've even taken and printed that out and left out the last word and had people come back to ask me uh, what was the last word. So, yeah. Anyway, Lovecraft he talks a lot about evil in his books. He talks about the ancient ones, the old ones, uh, whatever you want to call them. Cthulhu is uh, one of the characters in one of his stories, or maybe a couple of his stories. But he never portrayed the evil as being good. He always the way that I read him was he portrayed dabbling as uh, something that's going to get you in the end. I mean, the characters in the stories, uh, they never came to a good end. Um, they never did. So what I'm thinking in this, this is what I was getting to is the uh, the people that are in charge of everything that goes on uh, are um, the black government, dark government, whatever you want to call them, the deep state. The ones that are pulling the strings. Um, I think that they're going to find out Did the evil's going to get them in the end? Well, I know they are. But um, I, I don't know how they can keep going with this and not, I mean, and think that everything's going to be cool. Because everything's falling apart. Unless you think like I do, everything's not falling apart, everything's falling together. Because, you know, Jesus is coming. And um, anyway, they're tearing this world down just as hard and fast as they can. So that's just kind of what I was pondering this morning on the way into work. It ain't going in like they want them to, like they want it to. So y'all have a good day and God bless you.